Who owns PAD specialists? Strengths versus weakness? So I'm the founder of PAD specialists. I'm not the sole owner. I am plurality owner, but PAD specialists is 100% owned by physicians as of the date of this recording, December 2021. Um, we're 100% physician owned and operated. We don't have any outside corporate ownership, not physician ownership. I think there's some advantages to this because um, we do understand the healthcare system and patient care a little more than non-physicians would. We do prioritize patient care above all else. There's certainly things a healthcare business could do in the short term to raise profit, even if it's a slight expense of patient care. We don't believe in that at all. We believe in long-term. Long-term growth means focusing on the patient at all times. Even if that means short-term, we lose money. That's okay. Even if that means sometimes turn a patient away because they don't quite meet the criteria for procedure. It's the right thing to do, we do it. Even if that means the patient meets the criteria for procedure, but they have some comorbidities that should be done in the hospital. It's the right thing to do. Always, we always focus on the patient in both in the long term, whatever that means in the short term. That's our business philosophy, and that has served us well for these five years that we've been operational, and it's going to serve us well going forward. So I believe this is a unique strength we have by being 100% physician-owned. We're patient-centric first and foremost. Weaknesses of being a only physician-owned model? No, I, I will see this, that maybe there's some more lessons we can learn from other industries about efficiencies, about quality, about speed that we haven't yet learned. You know, we've learned a lot. I've learned a lot since we started this journey five years ago, but there's a lot yet I haven't learned. So I admit that there's things that I don't know that I don't know. Are there things that we can learn from other industries? Probably. So these are some relative weaknesses, but this is our professional journey of, uh, of business and life. We're always learning and we're always open to learn from others, from everyone from patients, referring physicians, proceduralists, our team members, our staff, and from other industries and individuals outside of even healthcare. This is our philosophy, continuous growth, continuous development, continuous improvement.